And now, the news program that starts your day off right. Good morning, South Park. The South Park vigilante struck again last night, this time at a meth lab in the downtown New Stort facility. Here with more is a midget in a fedora. Tom, six people were arrested last night after the vigilante exposed a huge meth lab in the storage facility behind me. Eyewitnesses have come forward with shocking reports that the vigilante's farts were so awful they seemed to actually rip the fabric of time. You ain't never heard a fart like this, man. It was like one minute he farted on my dick and the next thing my dick was like 20 seconds in the past. Finally, someone is standing up to all the crime in this city. If you ask me, these people here all deserve to be farted on. He's a menace if you ask me. How long before this vigilante gets radical and blows up a school or a church, huh? How long before Captain America becomes Captain Ideology? Huh? The third Captain America movie? How long was that? About six years? About six years! Dozens of protesters gathered outside the police station today as a warrant was issued for the vigilante's arrest. This city will not be victimized by mass crusaders who sneak around and fart on people at night. We urge all citizens to arm themselves and fight against this kind of rectal oppression. <sighs> yeah, it's me. Nobody knows anything about this kid. Not what race he is, not even if it's a boy or a girl. What do we do, sir? Just keep getting the product into people's drugs and alcohol. I'll handle the vigilante. This deal's getting out of control. You said you could get the mayor out of office. You wanted to be left alone, Commissioner. To do what you love doing. I've made that happen. Just stay calm and soon everyone will have exactly what they want. Kid, right? My name's Wendy. Nice to have you at our school. That little problem Call Girl told you about? It's a lot worse. The Chamber of Commerce wants to get rid of the vigilante no matter what it takes. You know the bathrooms in the park? Call Girl wants you to meet her there right now. Yeah, anyway, nice to have you in town, new kid. See? It just spun around and different clothes came on. That's dumb. Need to get somewhere fast, you kid? I'm the f f fastest kid in town. Catch you later. Hello there, new kid. We haven't been formally introduced. I'm Mr. Crime Syndicate Kingpin Guy, and you, you are the one who keeps farting on all my best people. We both want what's best for this city. I know you've probably got places to be, but why don't you come talk to me instead? I'm at the old Soto Sopa ruins. Come on, what do the Coon friends really have to offer you? Oh, 
stupid fucking cow! Have another glass of Chardonnay, why don't you? I have to drink to deal with you! That marijuana is changing you somehow! At least marijuana is natural, not like... grapes! You're fucking hot! Maybe so, but I'm not telling everyone our child's secrets! Go be paranoid some more in your room, Chris! Have another drink, Kelly! Go be paranoid some more in your room, Have Chris! Have another drink, Kelly! Oh, hey, kiddo! Daddy's gonna go upstairs to his room. Mommy's gonna go get a drink. <laughs> Go away, sweetie. This is mommy's crying time. I'm not crying. I'm laughing. <laughs> Stupid fucking bitch. Fucking hate you. Aren't you still grounded, young man? You really should learn not to talk back to your elders. It's for your own good, new kid. Children are like little beasts and need discipline, or they turn into bad people. Do you think it's weird for a husband not to want to see his wife naked? Aren't you still grounded, young man? You really should learn not to talk back to your elders. Are you looking to get grounded for life? Cause I can make that happen. 
No. Girls. Allowed. Okay, here's Farty Pants now. Come join us. Hello, it's me, the Keen Store. I have new super sweet inventory. <laughs> The Coon Store will be closed for President's Day. Oh my god, I can't talk to you right now. I have a lot of shit going on. If you do not see the item you're looking for, please file a request ticket. Thank you for shopping at the official store of Kuhn and Free. I may be fast, but I still like to take my time with the ladies. Uh-huh, I see you're back and trying to talk to me again. Can't talk now, Buttlord. Important strategy meeting. They say Dr. Timothy is a serious mindfucker. So, uh, how's Tweak? You seem okay? 
Coon friends, these are dark times. We now know for a fact that Scrambles the Missing Cat is part of a larger conspiracy. We also know that the fucking Freedom Pals have more information about this conspiracy than we do. Fact. Maybe we should just face it, guys. Maybe Freedom Pals have a better super franchise than we do. Hey, that's no way to talk, Mosquito. The only reason that Freedom Pals are ahead of us right now is because they're butt-fucking cheaters who sold out. Yeah, but Freedom Pals have Dr. Timothy and he can read people's minds and bend reality. Yeah, because he just said that. When we made up our superpowers, he was like, well, I have every power to do fucking everything. You think that's fair? It's time for us to be as dirty as them. We have to know what the Freedom Pals know. Well, how, how are we ever going to get the help of the Freedom Pals? We send a spy. Someone in our group who pretends to want to switch sides and join Freedom Pals. Somebody who they don't know very well. The new kid joins Freedom Pals, then asks for assistance investigating the community center. Hope the new kid is good at bullshitting. You'll never get past the security grids. They change it every day. I can get the new kid inside. I've got hacking abilities, remember? Because I'm a gadgeteer class with the tinkering ability. No dice, Chaos. You're just saying that to get out of jail. You better let him go. The new kid will need him. All right, fine. <laughs> get the new kid inside Freedom Pals base. OK. And if he tries anything funny, kill him. It's the coon store. Oh wait, that's fucking stupid. How do I delete these things? If you are not a registered member of Coon and Friends, please exit the coon store now. You're welcome. Butthole, what are you doing here? Thanks for helping with my dad, I really appreciate it. Okay, folks, we are com halfway complete. Hmm, that follower count is pretty impressive for a turd. <laughs> Thanks, turd. Guess I won't pummel you for now. Said, always right for the job. Hmm. All right.
first mobsters and now meth labs? No wonder Lord never comes to this stupid town anymore.